Um, well, I discussed it with the coaching staff. Uh, we, we, we knew Jamaica very powerful in the air, very strong. And, and we felt that a big part of their game would be, one, uh, getting crosses in on us, and then on the set plays, putting us under pressure. Uh, and in, in that situation, we just thought that uh, Sutton would be the best, best person to go with. Yes. Yeah, um, well, I mean, the, the, the individual defending of the back line was very good, but uh, I, I think the whole compactness of the team, uh, midfield and back line, um, you, you know, we, we, we kept it tight. Uh, managed to squeeze balls, don't give them a lot of speed. We were really concerned about the Fuller-Shelton combination. Um, early on, they, they put us under some trouble, but I, I, I think in general we solved that problem uh, very well. Yes? You said after uh, practice on Thursday that uh, you had an idea of uh, what to expect from Jamaica. Were you surprised with how well uh, your strategy uh, worked today when it came to keeping the ball away from them and keeping it in the middle? I think we could have done better. Um, I, I thought we played very well in the first half, created, created some good chances, uh, chances and half chances. In the second half, we opened brightly, uh, had two very good chances. I thought Ricketts was outstanding. Um, and, and then we fell apart a bit. Uh, I think we fatigued a bit. And, and when we fatigued, instead of keeping the ball and resting with it, um, we gave it away. And once you give it away, now you've got to work to get it back. Um, so uh, I think that is something we need to, to sit down and, and discuss and, and uh, do better in the next game. Yes. Talk a little bit about the goal. Yeah, um, well, it's as Ali described it, uh, the ball got wide, uh, Tarkowski, nice little overlap, and uh, the cross came in. I actually saw Ali peeling away, and I thought he was going to bring it down. I'm glad he didn't. <laughs> Um, but it was a great, great finish. Uh, nice play in general, but but a fantastic finish. Okay. Yeah. Oh. You can go first. Steven, it looked like you started with a 4-5-1 with Ali by himself up front. And then when you took off uh, Will Johnson to bring on Jackson, it gave him a bit more support up front. Did you feel that was key to developing the goal? And, and how did the two formations compare for you? Well, it, it wasn't intended to be a 4-5-1. Uh, it was supposed to be a 4-3-3. And we talked about that in the dressing room, that we, that we were lacking uh, penetration on both wide areas of the field. Um, we, we had a tendency to play in front of them, and I wasn't happy with that. Um, and, and when you play a 4-3-3 uh, and you're not getting the penetration out wide, then it, it ends up coming to be a 4-5-1. Um, so so we, we, we knew we had to make changes. It was just, a, you know, what, what's the timing would be the changes. Um, well, it wasn't so much, uh, um, you know, Johnson had to probably be sacrificed. Um, what, what we felt was we could we could get some we could get some penetration on on the left side with Josh coming in, and and then uh, Josh has a tendency to play a little bit higher up. Um, so Patrice is a little more disciplined in, in what he did, and, and Johnson did a lot of work. Um, so it was just you know six or one half a dozen of the other interchange really. No. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, he's trained very well. Um, I think he has some to prove. Um, and uh, Ali could tell you, he, he's been outstanding. Actually, both goalkeepers have been outstanding in training. Um, me personally, I, I could have gone with either one, but as I told you, we, we had a reasoning for that. But no, I'm not surprised. Okay, thank you very much, Ali, Coach Stephen Hart. Congratulations and good luck thank for the rest much. of the competition.